Welcome to Whova. If you are looking to submit a speaker proposal or abstract for an event that's using Whova, you are in the right place. Let's go through the submission process so you have the best chance of being selected as a speaker. You will likely have received an invitation email from the event organizer containing a link to the submission portal, or you can find the link on the event's website or social media. Open up the link, and you'll see all of the details for the event, with info such as what kind of speakers they are looking for, and any topics of interest. You'll also see the start date and deadline for submissions. If you've read through the event's information and you're interested in becoming a speaker at the event, click Start Proposal to begin. First, enter your email and click Continue. Then, create a Whova account by filling out your email, name, and a password and clicking Create Account. You will then receive a code in your email to verify your account. If you don't see it, make sure to check your spam folder. Once you've created an account and logged in, you will be able to fill out the submission form. Start by filling out your speaker information, including your name and email, affiliation, bio, and more. You can also choose to upload a profile picture. Then, fill out your submission details, including the title, summary, keywords, and any additional info the organizers want to collect. This is where you'll get to highlight all the interesting content you'll be covering in your submission and why it's a perfect fit for the event. Depending on what your event is looking for, you may also be able to include the ability to select a track or session type or include a supporting document. Use these tools to add all the extra relevant info and help make your submission stand out to the event's reviewers. You may also be able to add any co-speakers. Here, Enter their name and email and any additional information such as their affiliation or bio. Then, read and consent to any organizer terms that have been included. It's important to read this carefully to make sure your submission is able to pass through to the submission stages and you can be accepted as a speaker. Finally, save your draft or submit it. If you are submitting your proposal, it is likely that the event organizer has not allowed the ability to edit submissions, and you will get a pop-up letting you know. If you would like to make changes later, you can save it as a draft for now, just make sure you submit it before the deadline. If the organizer has enabled the ability to edit, the pop-up will let you know when you are able to edit your submission until. Then, click Submit. You will now see a confirmation message and receive an email confirming that your response has been submitted. If your event organizer allows multiple submissions, you will be able to click Start Another Proposal to submit another one, potentially increasing your chances of getting accepted. You will also now be able to click All Your Submissions to see a full list of your submissions and drafts. You will be able to see the status of all your submissions so that you can easily track their progress, including if it's a draft, submitted, waitlisted, accepted, or withdrawn. To view an individual submission, click Open. Here, you can view all of the submission details. Additionally, if the event organizers have allowed the ability to edit submissions, you will be able to do that here. Once your proposal or abstract has been reviewed, the event organizers will decide if they want to move forward with your submission. If your proposal or abstract is accepted, you will receive an email from the event organizers letting you know, and your session and speaker information will be added to the event's agenda. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoy your time with Whova. If you have any questions regarding your call for speaker submission, reach out to your event organizer.